Pat and I were just talking in the break about the uh, incredible, um, uh, incredible record this president has of horrible, horrible gaffes, um, especially when it comes to foreign countries. Um, and it's not just him. It's just, it's the whole State Department. I mean, Hillary Clinton with the Russian, the button, and it was, uh, what an embarrassment. The president with his um, uh, with his speeches on uh, tape for the Queen. Oh yeah, well, um, bowing. How about bowing to everybody, including the Saudi King? He bows to vir- virtually, including the Mayor of Tampa. He bowed to uh, his Special Olympics comment on Jay Leno when he talked about bowling like a Special Olympian. These, I mean, those are pretty bad faux pas. Uninvited guests at the White House functions. He snubbed Netanyahu for dinner the first time uh, Netanyahu came to America uh, to visit. I mean, there's, and you remember when when Bush was in China and he went to the wrong door and it was locked. Yes, and how much was made of that? I mean, this is one thing after another. Like they're third graders. And it's no big deal for mainstream. Nothing. No big Pester, deal. Pe- the, you know, look, um, we're going to talk to you uh, later on in the uh, program today about some um, some things that are coming this summer. And I will tell you that the press is not going to cover it. And I am I am very, very concerned that we are up on Memorial Day weekend and you are going to... Um, do what I do and everybody else does on Memorial Day weekend. You start, you know, you start uh, spending more time with the kids and more time outdoors and you don't pay attention and uh, you get back. This time you get back in September and the whole world could have changed. Um, I don't know if anybody is um, really paying attention um, in a great group or great number of uh, of people especially with what's happening in geopolitical politics and what's happening over in the Middle East. Um, and nobody in the media is going to tell you the truth. Um, you know, th- there was a, there was a uh, article in the um, English press uh, today. What was the name of this columnist that did this? Uh, Niall Gardner. Niall Gardner. He does, um, he does top ten insults ag- against Great Britain. Now we have we have talked about some of these, mm-hmm. but I mean uh, the top ten assumes that there's at least eleven insults. <laughs> yeah. um, but yeah. top ten uh, ways that Osama or uh, Obama has insulted um, Great Britain. You have to listen to this list. It is it's staggering when you look at them, and then when you couple that with what he's done with Israel. And the the complicity of the press and what the press is probably willing to do this summer. Um, buckle up, gang. Buckle-